Uh, and what about Mercedes back to mount a challenge in 2023? Do you think Lewis likelier than, than, than George to spearhead it or, or not? I think Lewis and George are incredibly evenly matched. If you microanalyze this season just gone, they were very close. Uh, take away unreliability or uh, safety car situations, what have you. Um, we saw in Brazil just how closely matched they are. Uh, there are points in the second half of the season. You could say Lewis had the upper hand, but George will only get more confident and more experienced. There will be a, a subtle changeover uh, at some point in the future, inevitably as Lewis moves into his late 30s, early 40s. Depends how long they're teammates, of course. But uh, I see them being extremely uh, equal and level next year. And Mercedes must be smiling. They've got they've got the continuity. They've got uh, they're very stable in terms of who's running the team. I think they know what's wrong with their car. They'll come back with a much stronger car. Um, yeah, as I say, Toto is a stakeholder there, unusually uh, amongst the bosses. That he's a man who's monetized and gathered power and influence in Formula One faster than anybody I've ever known. Probably even including Bernie Ecclestone, frankly and. Christian Horner, well settled at uh, uh, Red Bull. Red Bull have lost Dietrich Mateschitz, the boss. The buck stopped with him on pretty much all the big decisions. So they'll just be finding their way in, in a new setup. But if you just, Mercedes and Red Bull will be smiling at Ferrari and McLaren and others uh, having fundamental changes in their management. But I do see Mercedes taking the fight to Red Bull and Ferrari next year.